Good morning, you guys. Today is Wednesday, August the 4th, and I'm coming on camera looking one, like I just woke up because I just literally did. And two, I feel like a walking zombie, you guys. First of all, I have not recorded Monday and Tuesday because it's just, anyway, it's just too much. Well, I ain't gonna say it's too much going on. Yeah. Anyway, y'all, I have not really gotten no sleep in two days, okay? And the reason why is because something is wrong with Khalil, and I can't wait until his doctor open up because I got to see what's going on. Hold on, let me see. They open at 8. The reason why I think something is wrong with him is because, y'all, he has been crying, like, nonstop at night. Um, at first, you know, I thought it was him teething, so I was giving him, like, the teething tablets to calm him down. But last night, ooh, I'm so sorry, y'all. I haven't gotten no sleep. I pretty much haven't gotten no sleep since 1 a.m. But, um... And it's 7 in the morning. But anyway, let me try to talk fast because I got just things to do. So, I thought it was him teething at first because I'm like, what else could be wrong with him? But the thing that I don't know if it's teething or not is because it's not like he's chewing on things. Like, you know, his like, like for instance, Kaylani, as soon as you put something in her hand, it go right to her mouth. And like, she just chews on everything. However, he's not doing that. The most he's doing is um, drooling. But every single night, y'all, he has been like, just not going to sleep. Like literally to the point where as soon as... The pacifier drop out his mouth. He start crying. But last night, he woke up at one something. He cried all the way until like two. And then he went to sleep for like an hour. He woke up and just was crying, crying, crying. I literally had to keep rocking him. And even though he would eventually fall back to sleep, I had to stay up. Because as soon as he would start crying, I had to, you know, keep like just i don't know i just was pretty much just like rubbing his forehead i mean not his forehead like rubbing caressing his cheek and you know every time he would start crying i just be like you know mommy right here i'm right here i didn't go nowhere you know and he would calm down but i don't know what's wrong so as soon as the doctor opened i'm making an appointment because i don't know what's going on he he woke kaylani up throughout the night and luckily luckily she is a uh, good, you know, she's good. Like, she doesn't really cry. So, she was fine. Like, I woke up this morning. Like, he finally been asleep for the past hour. And, um, he finally been, he finally been asleep. He finally been, oh, I can't even fucking talk, Lord Jesus. <laughs> he finally been asleep for the past hour. So, I was able to doze off for, like, 30 minutes or so and when I woke up she was up I'm looking at the camera y'all sorry when I woke up she was up but she was just watching TV she wasn't crying or nothing so as soon as the doctor offered open I'll make it up on me because I can't do this Hi, I was calling to see if I could make an appointment for my son, um, Khalil. And his date of birth? 2 18 21. What kind of problem is Khalil having? Um, to be honest, I'm, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Um, for the past couple of days, every night he just pretty much won't go to sleep. He keeps crying. And it almost sounds like he's saying like ow, but I don't think he's old enough to really know if something like, I mean to say ow, but you know, he just keeps crying and crying and crying every night. Like he's just irritable. I thought he was, you know, it was due to him teething at first. So I was giving him teething tablets, but it, you know, it's still the same issue. So, you know, I'm just trying to see what's going on because this is not like him at all. Like he doesn't want me to hold him. He does, he just, 
he just seemed like he's very miserable. All right, any fever at all? No, I checked this morning and it was 90, 98.7. Okay. Um, any cough? No cough, no. And no runny or stuffy nose? Um, he does have a stuffy nose, but he's had, yeah, he has a stuffy nose. It, it, it was like, uh, I would say about a week ago, it was really bad, but now it's just like, I guess the, the aftermath of it. Okay. So, um, I'll get you in here. Um, and do you find it better if you're holding him like upright? It's just yeah. when he lays down? Yeah, when I hold him upright, like if it's upright and I turn him around, like to not his face not towards me but away from me, he seems to be fine. But if I'm laying him down or trying to cradle him or anything like that, he starts crying. Um, and that that could be sometimes when their ears hurt, they hurt worse to lay down. Oh, okay. Um, so look, I'm gonna get you in here. Um. Can you come in at 315 today? Yes, I can do 315. Um, let me ask you a question as far as the ears. So, would, if would he be pulling at his ears, or is he not old enough to to do that? It's, you know, I'm not a nurse. Oh, okay. I can tell you that for certain, but often they do, but often they don't. So, you know, it's kind of 50 50. Okay. Um, and you know what? All right, yeah, three, three, no, three, I know that if you lie them down, that pain is worse. I think it's the way the fluid moves in the ear, but when they're sitting up, sometimes they feel a little better. So one thing that they recommend, if in fact that is the case, is you elevate the bed. But with the, with the age of your child, mm -hmm. you've got to see him. Okay, uh, yeah, I definitely want to bring him in because, I mean, during the day, he's not like that. It's like at night, it's, I don't, I don't know. So, yeah, I could definitely come today. All right, now, when you get here, you need to go to the back of the building, and you're going to park around the back, and you'll see blue signs in front of the parking spots. Pull into one of the spots with a blue sign, and then call into the office, and we'll check you in from your car. Uh, once we check you in, then a nurse will come out and get you and um, bring you into the room. Okay. 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 Now, um, as long as everything remains the same, the baby doesn't seem to get worse or anything like that, then we're going to see you at 315. If anything changes, you call me back. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, thank you. All right. You're so welcome. You take care. We'll take care everything this afternoon okay all right thank you all right bye-bye bye-bye okay so it's still the same day y'all um, i'm on my way to my training session i was this close to canceling it because i y'all when i say i did not get no sleep i was so close to can canceling it but i just drank me some coffee as y'all saw and i just said you know what I'm going, you know, I'm trying not to make no excuses, so I'm going, um, but his appointment is at 3.15, as y'all heard, and right now he's at home with his dad, so, since he's at home with his dad, I was like, you know, I mean, right now he's fine, when I looked online as far as what it could be, they did say that it could be like him having an ear, oh, I'm putting my seatbelt on, sorry sorry mom they did say it could him be having an ear infection however what i don't understand is if it's an ear infection why is he sleeping during the day but not at night that's what i don't understand so his daddy not gonna come with me because um you know it's no point in bringing both of the babies out and it's raining outside today and not only that as y'all heard they want me to come in the back of the building i'm assuming because they don't know if he has covid or not so you know they don't want to possibly infect you know other people but yeah so i'm on my way to my training session though he told me 9 30 right now so i hope my baby is okay y'all because I, I just, 
I just, I don't know. I felt, well, I ain't feel bad because I know it's not nothing that I did. But I just felt like, I felt so helpless because it's like he's a baby. He can't tell me what's wrong. All he can do is cry. So I didn't get frustrated, you know, even though I know, you know, if, if you're a mom and you have ever got frustrated, I'm trust me, I'm not judging you because I get frustrated as well. But I didn't get frustrated because I know that he's a baby and he can't tell me what's wrong. All he can do is cry. Um, so I just hope that, you know, they give him some medicine. I just hope he'll be okay because I don't want him to keep going through that, you know. But... You know what, y'all? <laughs> uh, people get on my damn nerves all that time. They about to leave. Y'all, all that time I'm sitting here waiting for her to pull out, she ain't pull out. As soon as I pull off, as soon as I pull off, I'm not moving this time. The car behind me just gonna have to wait. As soon as I pull um, off, because I ain't wanna hold the cars up behind me, she pulled out and the car behind me got that parking spot. But it's all right, cause guess what? I got a closer park. <laughs> okay, so I worked out for almost 40 minutes and I burnt 318 calories. I definitely want to burn some more, so I'm about to go to, I'm about to go on One Life and do some cardio, even though I don't want to, but <laughs> I keep telling myself that I'm going to do two-a-days, and I know I'm not. 
the only reason why I know I'm not gonna do two days is because by the time that I you know at nighttime I be tired okay after working dealing with the twins dealing with the other kids I be tired I ain't got time for that everything you so how y'all feel about the baby situation with him getting canceled and all this other stuff I seen somebody I definitely feel like that he should not have said what he said like you want to engage the crowd but that's how you do so like you just did a little bit too much well a lot too much you did too much and then not only that when he got backlash for it he was very unapologetic like the apology he gave was so sorry and he had like he didn't care and act like he couldn't be canceled and all of this other stuff saying that oh i thought that i was gonna be a rapper for at least one more year but y'all making me an icon like sir what <laughs> now you losing money all around <laughs> so I just feel like he definitely shouldn't have said it. I feel like that he's too cocky. Like, humble yourself. You definitely can get canceled. I don't care how many hits you have. You can get canceled, boo-boo. But anyway, my camera about to go dead, y'all. So I'm about to go in here, sit in the sauna, then get on the treadmill, and then I'm done for today. Okay, it's a little later, y'all. I'm finally on my way to the doctor's appointment for Khalil. Always was a whiner. But I just feel like now it's like on a whole nother level. But I'm a bit cranky because I'm so, like, I'm sleepy. I am tired. I need a nap expeditiously. Like, for real. I really need a nap. Y'all, after traveling what seemed like been 55 motherfucking hours, I'm here. Hey. All right, let me call them. They got my baby coming through the back door. You know what I'm saying? Back door employee and sit. They got us going through the employee entrance. God dang. I gotta ask for a master because I forgot my mask. Hi, my son Khalil has an appointment. Um, I just was letting you all know that I was in the back. Okay, bear with me. First name. Khalil. How you call it? K H A L I L and the date of birth 21821 and which space are you in? I'm in space six. Okay, I'm gonna have the nurse to come get you. Okay, okay, kids, do you all have a mask that somebody can bring? Because I forgot mine. I know she like, girl, how you forget your mask? You literally had one task, and that was to bring your mask and the baby, but definitely your mask. <laughs> Okay, boo boo, we here. I see you back there. I, I hear you. I hear you clawing. Hello. Hello. Okay, and what space are you in? Six. Okay, thank you. Bye thank bye. you. Didn't I say that the first call? I don't know. Hey, boo boo. We gonna see what's wrong with you. We gonna see what's wrong with the baby so you can sleep. And mommy can sleep. Huh? We gonna see what's wrong with the baby. Huh? Hi, boo -boo. <laughs> <laughs> what? You see yourself? You see yourself? What you crying for? Huh? Say, who is that, mommy? That's you, boo boo. That's you. <laughs> okay, y'all. So, we just got out of the doctor's office. First of all, Khalil is 19 pounds and 6 ounces. He big. <laughs> okay. Um, Ain't nothing wrong with him at all. No ear infection. They checked his blood. She said his white blood cells was fine. She checked everything, and everything was fine. I told her, I said, well, something ain't right. Something gotta be wrong, cause honey, I can't sleep. I'm sorry, I'm trying to get up, okay. So, she just was saying to give him some Tylenol because I asked her, you know, does are the teething, 
do the te teething tablets work? She said it really doesn't do anything. And I was like, well, what about, you know, like Orgel? She was like, Orgel only, you know, lasts for about 30 minutes. So she was saying to give him some Tylenol tonight before he go to bed. So that will pretty much help if it is from teething. Um, really, she said that's the only thing that it could be because she was saying that everything is fine both of his ears look fine his lungs was fine his stomach was fine everything was fine <laughs> literally everything so i don't know she also told me to start like trying to spoon feed him which i was i did try to spoon feed him before but it was like he just wasn't like he just i will put it in his mouth and he'll just let it fall right out so i'm like well maybe you're not ready whatever so i stopped doing that well, y'all, I'm about to go home, and I am going to go ahead and um, honestly go home, take a shower, and lay down because I am tired. I am tired, and I probably wake up later if I feel up to it and work out at night. So, I'm going to go ahead and end out today, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. Today is Thursday, August the 5th. Okay, August the 5th. I woke up in a much better mood than I did yesterday. Because yesterday I felt like I was ready to fight. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, whew, yesterday just, I was so tired and like, I just ain't want to be bothered by nobody. But today is a new day. I just dropped Noel off at daycare which Noel is my six-year-old. I dropped him off at daycare and now we are on our way to my training session. Today is the fourth week of my training session. This is the last workout of the week. Next week, we be turning it up a notch. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got no water. I need to get some water. That means I gotta get out the car. I should ask my baby daddy, do he want to do something today? Let me call him. Let me call my baby daddy. Hello. What you doing? You got done changing your shitty corner? At least she shit. Did she cry? No, I ain't I thought we did that the whole time. I'm gonna check in on her. Oh, she done, sir. I was calling to ask you if you wanted to be my date today to go somewhere. Sure. <laughs> Whatever. All right. Bye. We probably can stay on this side, honestly. I mean, on that side. Because I probably can go to the Whole Food Market and get some water. They probably they should have it there to avoid that traffic if it is traffic. All right, okay. All right bye. <laughs> I'm about to tell y'all something. I can't. I'll be trying to talk to y'all like y'all my friends or something. Well, y'all is my friends, but I be trying to you know put y'all in on like you know. I can't tell y'all that. Let, let's just say. I'm about to call my sister back because she called me and I ain't talked to her in a couple of days. Bye. We are about to go eat and I need to go to um the Whole Food Market to get some um cases of water. But I want to get cute and kind of take a picture today. And also because my last vlog, I literally did not put any makeup on the whole vlog. So this vlog, I kind of definitely want to like look nice for you guys because I feel like, I mean, this is real life, yes, but you know, how am I going to influence if I ain't influencing nothing but raggedy? So I'm about to go clean my sponges because they are dirty. So, I only have a little bit left, but to clean my sponges, I use the Dr. Bronner's um, 
peppermint peppermint so like really i don't use like a specific type i would prefer the unscented however i don't have any sure i will use whatever i have i actually had bought a um a set from amazon amazon sells like the samplers i guess you can call it a sampler set where it has all the different scents and i had bought that so i just be using that it's a bubble can i see it <laughs> All right, y'all. So I'm ready now. We had to make a stop at, I don't think y'all could really see me, but we had to make a stop at the Whole Food Market because I need to get some water. And I only, well, I ain't gonna say only. On my broke days, I might drink Aquafina, but for the most part, I drink Essentia. He drinks Fiji, nasty. If you drink Fiji water, you are nasty. That water have a taste. I don't care what nobody say, it has a taste to it. You up, boo boo? <laughs> All right, come on. Oh. Okay, so we found the bake, I mean the water. But they didn't have the cases. They only had like the, it was like six in a pack or whatever. Usually what I get is like 12. So now I'm looking for the bagels that I'll be getting. I don't see them though. Nope. nope. Okay, I need to get some shrimp. Well, that should be. I was looking for the fresh one, but I guess it don't matter because either way, I'm gonna freeze it. Right? That's a farm raised. Farm raised not good for you, so do wild caught. Let me see what they got over there. Hold on one second. Uh, oh, they got some shit right here. Let's see. Ooh, look at them, y'all. Okay, now we about to go eat. Yes. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. At Texas Roadhouse. Yummy in my tummy. Put it up. <laughs> that, what you get? Looking. And this right here. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, Boo Boo. Hey, Mama. Hi. I was so hungry, y'all, that I didn't even record. Oh, oh he keep he being lazy. She keep crying like something wrong with her. Let me try. And I got me a little drinky drink also. Y'all, I completely forgot to show y'all my food because I was bugging it up. But I got the country fried chicken and I got a little baby potato and some rice. And he got he dropped me and got the country fried chicken with a sweet potato and corn. And he's multitasking over there. <laughs> and this girl keeps trying to slide out her car seat. Good morning, you guys, and happy Friday. Um check all my perimeters. Why the y'all, some weird stuff is happening this morning. Let me tell y'all. Okay. And it just made me think about it because they're gonna fly was on my windshield just crawling like don't y'all fly why why is you i mean i i don't know but you know usually they move they fly away when with movement why are you still crawling on my windshield <laughs> anyway this morning y'all first of all i had a nine o'clock meeting this morning right right first of all that's too early you know what, what, what do we have to talk about at nine o'clock in the morning and then when i logged on i mean okay so i'm on my meeting or whatever and i'm sitting here trying to um 
make some coffee because I'm like, I need some coffee in my life to get my life together. Y'all, I'm walking with my mug in my hand. A fly flew right in my ear. I mean, I heard the buzz and everything. And I don't know why, but that is one of like my, I just, I do not, first of all, I do not like flies at all. I don't like any bugs. But I really hate when I hear the buzz. Like the, bu the, the buzz is what get me. So then, that made me drop my coffee, right? Right, right, okay. So then it landed in the chair, on the chair, so I went and got some, um, a newspaper thing to swap. Y'all, I swatted it, and it sent the, AD, the ADT alarm off. So that fly had it out for me this morning. That's all I can say. No, I ain't lying. I ain't hiding. I've been grinding, multiplying. I've been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away. You always posting up pictures, trying to look like you're winning. I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen, soaking in moments we live in. Yeah, you got the nerve to be on me. Faking your life for the IG If you got my number, don't add me Cause baby, I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus mm -hmm. I'm on hiatus uh -huh. Baby, don't check for me Taking time out to be Okay, so I know I didn't close out anything yesterday, but I didn't do anything. Literally, after I got my nails done, I came home and I sat in the house all day. So I was in here, I had like three drinks that I made myself. And um, yeah, and I was just here chilling, <laughs> doing nothing. Then I went to sleep later on that day. I wanted to go outside and sit on the porch, but yesterday the twins was tripping, okay? Both of them, 
both of them both of them anyway <laughs> yeah over there looking at me let me show y'all my nails hold on wait can you see yeah they are so pretty i love them i love them i love them my nail tech sheet absolutely y'all why the fuck do my knuckles look like that that must look ugly <laughs> anyway kehlani is asleep but mr khalil is up say hey boo boo say hi boo boo say hi you guys so remember i told y'all he was teething so i got him uh amber if he let me show y'all i got him a hold on wait <laughs> Okay, I got him an amber teething necklace. So my manager had told me about it. And I was like, I looked it up, but I ain't buy it. And then after I had took him to the doctor, oh, my battery dying. BRB. I'm back. So I think I was talking about the necklace. So anyway, my manager had told me about it. And then after I took him to the doctor, um, I was texting my friend and she was telling me that she was about to get her son the necklace because he's around like the same age as the twins. Let me turn the light on because it's so dark in here. Can y'all see me better? Let there be light. So that's what made me get it. Honestly, y'all, I don't know if I could tell a difference because he really, he hasn't been crying over, I, I assume he was crying over him teething, but he's been sleeping fine and he hasn't been like more whiny than usual. Um, but I also been giving him Tylenol. So I only been giving him the Tylenol like during at night though. So during the day he was, he's fine. So anyway, I'm about to live life on the edge. I know somebody out there is going to judge me and say that this is not healthy say that it's nasty and all of these other things I don't care <laughs> I have not eaten these in a while but I really love noodles <laughs> and these are the these I like this brand okay I don't like no other brand other than this brand but let me show y'all how I make my noodles so I know somebody out there is gonna be like because my boyfriend be like oh my gosh you are disgusting <laughs> Firstly, what I'm going to do is I am going to boil some eggs. I think I want to create a reel for this. Um, oh, I need some eggs. I'm using my last two. Hold on, y'all. Okay. So, I want to create a reel with it, though. I don't know why. I'm trying to just create reels. I'm going to create a reel. Can y'all see it? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to create a reel. I'm going to show. Okay. So, I'm going to do that. And then, I think I'm going to, oh wait. I'm going to add a clip of me turning on the fire. Oh, that look a little dirty. I'm going to add a clip of me turning on the fire. Okay, so I'm gonna let these boil. These are a little behind the scenes. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and let that boil. Then I'm gonna cook those. I cook those last because they take a while. And then I'm gonna show y'all the finishing touch. <laughs> okay so now my eggs are boiling so let me go back to my reel okay so it already saved it so let me just do a video of it boiling okay now what I do is, y'all, I just go ahead and add, I, oh wait, I'm, I'm messing up, I'm doing too much at one time.
Oh no, I put day. I got this part in here that I don't want in there. It's like a, I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's like a stain right there. And I don't want that in there. Okay, I did like a little zoom in. Okay, so now I only like chicken. I don't like no. I used to like beef. The beef is good too. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna well. The beef good. Okay, let me try to get. Oh, oh, oh. See, that's the only thing I don't like about it. It's messy. Okay. I can't redo that part. Damn, you can see it just a little bit. But I'm not redoing that part. You guys, listen, let me tell you. I do not like my noodles to, like, I don't like my noodles soggy at all, okay? I don't, the moment that they soggy, I don't want them. So, I'm gonna go ahead and, and rinse these eggs off. Now, I peeled my eggs. <laughs> now, let me check my noodles, cause I don't, see, see, see? It's like, probably, i say one more minute, if that. So I need to stay by and watch it so I could pour it out. I'm gonna go ahead and cut my noodles, I mean my eggs up. I don't like no water, you guys. No water, okay? No water. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut my eggs. I guess I could do a reel with that. I mean, show me cutting my eggs. Y'all getting some BTS of me making my reel. It ain't gotta be perfect. Okay. Oh, All right, I'm gonna just show that little part. Okay, okay. So now, oops. Let's go back to the noodles. Okay. <laughs> we, oh shit. Not the camera about the ball. All right. We back at the noodles. The noodles is nice and dry, like I like them. Okay. So now. We're gonna get a bowl, put it in the bowl, right? Like so, like that. <laughs> and my Timothy, I mean, tap with the brown voice. Okay, let's go back to the eggs. Back to the eggs. Lord, I'm making a mess. I can clean it up though. No redies. Where is that? Where, where is the finish touch? <laughs> okay, y'all. This is the finishing touch. All right, I gotta get do this in one take, y'all. it out <gasps> all right not too late okay. oh my gosh come on now ketchup the ketchup is not a new one so it's like messing up get down there ah it's not 
no, this ain't gonna work. I need some new ketchup. Cause it's not squirting out like I want it to. Ugh. I gotta use packets, that's ghetto. What, boo boo? <laughs> this is so ghetto. That's just gonna have to be what it is. <laughs> All right, y'all. That's it. Bon appetit. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? <laughs> you know what else I'm gonna do? <laughs> just for giggles. Boom, boom. I'm about to pour my cold water. No, I think you should be able to see. I think you should be able to see that it's Essentia water because you know we bougie you know what i'm saying we bougie ain't no no aquafina around here or fiji because fiji is my thing it's whatever freak it i'm hungry now <laughs> all right y'all bye you guys i put that post up not even 30 minutes ago let me show y'all hold on i gotta go through my stories you see that? It say 28 minutes at the top. Let me show y'all how many, how, you see that? Do y'all see that? 7,245. I just posted a healthy one not too long ago. That got 171. That, and I posted that, what? That was like days ago I posted that. So do I need to post? Do I need to post reels? With all type of stuff in it with the noodles. I'll put barbecue sauce, hot sauce. What y'all want me to put? I, mustard? Let me... Is that what I gotta do? <laughs> you guys, it is... Y'all, it's much later now. It is 9... 9.02. I just gave the twins a bath. And I washed my oldest son hair. And I already took my shower <clears throat> earlier. Um, so now I'm about to fix me and my oldest son some cookies. <laughs> so, I already got the oven. The oven is preferred. Right now, these, these, these are the cookies that I like. You can eat or bake. You don't have to, like, you can eat the cookie dough. And it already comes in cubes. However, when I first got them, I kind of let them sit out for too long once I left the grocery store so well I guess they still they still kind of in cubes so yeah how many you want 11 oh four four you gonna eat all four it's how many what do you mean it's how many total it's eight in there oh I thought you were gonna go check on them the twins are upstairs I just um I told you I just gave them a bath so they are upstairs. Khalil, he's just laying down because he had already ate. And um, Kehlani is upstairs drinking her bottle. Damn it. Come on, let me put this right back on the bowl. Go check on them for me. Just make sure they're okay, please. So, in the meantime, you guys, I am about to watch this movie. I literally have not did anything all day. I feel like I've been saying that all week, but I really haven't. Today, it was raining all day, like pouring down raining. So, today was just a cute little vibe. I woke up this morning, and I wrote in my journal, and I wrote down some goals for the rest of the year, stuff like that. And then, I was a mom for the rest of the day. <laughs> so... I'm just about to sit here and finish watching this movie. The movie I'm watching is called, let me show y'all. It is this movie called, can you see it? Okay, it's this movie called Evil Eye. So just to tell y'all what it's about right quick, cause it's actually a good movie. So the girl, she lives, she's there in the end. So her parents live back in Delhi. And, um, or Delhi, I'm not sure how it's pronounced, but she lives in America and her mom has really been wanting her to find a man, find a man, find a man. And then she finally found somebody and now her mom doesn't want her to be with that person. But the reason why her mother doesn't want her to be with that person is because when her mom um, was like younger, when her mom was pregnant with her, her mom was like dating somebody and 
she got abused by the dude and she ended up killing him and before he died she feels like that he put some type of curse on her unborn child which is now this girl and um she feels like the dude that she he, her daughter met is like a reincarnation of the dude she killed and the reason why she feels that way is because this guy that her daughter has met has been saying things that the guy that used to abuse the mom what would say and um he was born exactly nine months after she killed him so she feels like that this dude is reincarnated and everybody thinks she crazy i was laughing because she was telling her husband everything that i just told y'all and her husband just looked at her like come here i'm gonna get you some help like bitch you crazy <laughs> but i think that she really um is on to something and nobody is believing her so she literally just told her daughter how she felt as far as she feel like that her daughter's boyfriend is the reincarnation of the guy that she killed so her daughter was laughing at her so i'm just about to finish this i i got is what i got about 30 minutes left of it the cookies are cooking they should take like 10 minutes so I'll come back on here when the cookies are done, you guys. And then I'm going to close out the vlog. I know you're going to miss me until next week. Like, what are you going to do with your life? I know. But I'll have another one next Sunday for you guys. Um, I don't want you to think that this is just going to be vlog, 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 vlog. But I was supposed to upload a video Wednesday, which I keep saying that I'm going to upload. However, um, Khalil wasn't feeling good and... I just the video is gonna consist of them being in it so I just you know I need for them to like be acting right so this week I just been really trying to it's just been a whirlwind because Khalil was sick he was keeping me up at night I felt like I wasn't getting no sleep while I'm still trying to work out and do other things of course I have two other kids other than the twins so it's like you know it just was too much going on so y'all getting another vlog <laughs> even though the last video was a vlog but i promise the next video is not gonna be a vlog so yeah so i'll be back when the cookies are done you guys so you can see how good they look if i don't burn them <laughs> all right y'all the cookies are done i'm mad because my son gave me the messed up ones but cookies and milk go over there with her so you can make sure she don't fall cookies and milk and that's it y'all that's it for this vlog you guys Kaylani woke up so guess what i gotta go deal with that as you hear her crying in the background she woke up thanks to her let me tell y'all i tell my son oh you know one of their pacifiers fell out can you please go get on the pacifier he gotta run and stomp his way into the room which wakes them up turn on the light you don't do none of that you you no light okay but now i gotta go put them back to sleep so that's it for this vlog you guys i hope you enjoyed bye i am talking about you yes because go ahead bye you go ahead and take her upstairs because you uh you woke them up that's it for this vlog i'm about to go upstairs eat my cookie we'll sleep. see he just turned the light on Kids don't understand. Let me, let me tell y'all something. I barely touch the light, y'all. I don't know if it's because I'm an adult. And I know how much light bills are. But I barely touch the light. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. I'll see y'all on my next one. Bye!